doing well today. It's a day that I look forward to because it's in such a good cause and something that's so dear to my heart. Well, two things that are dear to my heart, because Doctor Who is anyway. Um, and Denville Hall that we're doing this fundraising for is important to me. I am a Doctor Who Cares, raising money for the amazing Denville Hall, which is really the retirement home for everyone invo involved in the production business, the entertainment industry. Um, I've been there, it's a magnificent place, run by really lovely people, and uh, lots of lovely people living there. Yeah, lovely, it's always so nice to meet you know, your old friends, and, and nice to meet the fans who say such lovely things. I mean, somebody said to me today, um, it's so nice to see you because you're family. Well, we, one of the, the, the people who are fantastically supportive for me for the auction of Big Finish, they, they auction this day in the recording studio so that people can come and see what it's like recording a Big Finish, which has raised a lot of money today. I think that's probably raised the most. And we've had a lot of very, very generous donations for the auction. We always do, which has been... Um, we, I'm, I'm just so touched the way people bring stuff and give stuff. And actually, it's, it's one of the many uh, Doctor Who charity events uh, that go on all the year round. Now, this is organised by Lala Ward and uh, Derek Hambly of Tenth Planet. Oh, well, I'm very, yeah, I mean, uh, very excited because I've just been playing The Spoons with Fairport Convention, one of the great bands uh, who have uh, been around, and it's just, I'm such a fan of theirs. I've seen them play over the years and uh, met them a couple of times, but this, I got to play The Spoons with them. It was glorious, it was just glorious experience. doing anything I do with Big Finish. Well, Nick is a gracious host and um, really good in the booth. Um, I had a really good time, actually. There were all kinds of cool people. It was great fun. Toby's Lunch, famous. People go to work at that place just to eat Toby's Lunch. Um, that was good fun. I'll do, an, I'll do another one one of these days, I think. It's been a busy old year with Big Finish, I can tell you. Uh, working in January, I think, Nearly every month now I've popped in and done a couple of stories. Bonnie, and then Sophie, and uh, then uh, Bernie Summerfield, and then um, Holmes and Watson. <laughs> I mean, Colin, Colin goes around telling everybody that, in fact, I am not uh, a legitimate doctor because he never did the regeneration. No, no, that Colin Baker, I'll tell you a thing about him. He didn't bother to turn up on the day, so I saved the day and the universe by getting into his costume. Ratnaf lost me for three days because it's such a big costume, he's a big fella, you see. What's great about this story is that he will not be able to claim that I am no longer the legitimate doctor because he didn't pass it on. Huh? Exactly. See? We've all done it for you. Yes, well done. Colin thinks it's for him, but it's for me. Exactly. And he won't be able to, and then I will be the legitimate doctor. <laughs> I've been illegitimate all these years. Oh, my goodness. Well, you know, sort of, um, people do sometimes ask, uh, what are one's first thoughts? Um, uh, w being asked to recreate a character that has been going on for, went on for a long time, reached millions of people. Uh, well, the answer is, of course, thrilled. Uh, and so it is wonderful to be able to go back and, and do it again. And of course, as the years pass, uh, the voice tends to stay more the same than the face. Um, and, and therefore, you know, one can play the same character um, uh, more convincingly. I'm absolutely thrilled Gallifrey's been brought back. The feedback we kept getting, and presumably why Big Finish want to do some more, is that it was one of the series they really, really enjoyed and loved. And 
so that it's been brought back is going to be lovely for all of us. I think it'll make the fans happy. It'll certainly make me incredibly happy. I hope it'll make Louise and Sophie feel the same. We all get on so well together. It's been wonderful and um, I think everyone's having a really good time. Everybody's now listening to the band on stage. Um, Sylvester's probably still playing the spoons. He was earlier.